Well, number one, when you're 18, 19, 20 years of old age, even 17, you got to realize your parents are actually pretty damn smart. <laughs> and Ben, you have a young kid right now, and you said it's he's a, he or she's four months, right? You wait until they're 16, 17, or 18, and they, they think they know a lot more than you do, right? I've got two of those right now, and I smile because it reminds me of me. Had I listened to my father and really done the engineering route first, like truly gotten a master's degree in mechanical engineering or biomat, uh, biomechanics or some, some relevant field like that, it would have totally helped me in my uh, career that I do now. Uh, you know, right now, I mean, I'm prepared. I was prepared with the background, uh, but quite frankly, my dad, and he was right, I was always considered a dangerous engineer because I'm the guy without the actual formal degree. But my understanding and experience today has uh, just led me to incredible insights. I get to work with uh, engineers uh, from across different fields, whether it's biomechanics, uh, biomedical engineering, whatever. And I, I just, I guide and I ask them, I go, hey, I need this done. Here's what I want. Can you do it for me? So in, in that regard, I'm more of the, the supervisor of the project than the doer of the project anymore. And that's likely because I don't have the formal degree. Uh, but the person in, in a field of biomechanics, which is my love, mm -hmm. I think they're really set to be a chiropractor. Uh, number one, you can do a, a plethora of research. Uh, there's all types of research opportunities at chiropractic college nowadays for somebody that has a biomechanics uh, background and degree. Uh, but also, I think as a clinician, it changes the way you see the body. I mean, let's be frank, the, the body is an engineering marvel. It is a biomechanics machine. And if you don't understand biomechanics, you don't understand the human body, right? As a chiropractor, we apply forces to the body to create an outcome. And if you don't understand what those forces are and what they do, you, you have no idea into why somebody responds the way they do or why they don't, right? That's my take on it.